laughed at me. Y'all laughed at me. Well, who's laughing now? <laughs> All right, so what is going on today, YouTube? Well, we hope you guys did like um, that little intro, but today we are going to be talking about the list. Um, that just came out and I'm pretty sure everybody has already seen it. So, you know, there's no real um, Oh, uh, okay. We're lax windows. I understand my computer is going slow <laughs> Jesus Christ, you man, you just you just can't win for losing but uh, yeah, man We finally got our ban list which was hmm yesterday. I guess. Yeah, yeah yesterday um, Well from yeah when you see in this video um, it was recorded before that and you know you, you guys already know my computer acts up but we're not going to be going on about that but anyways yeah the band list did come out on friday so that's what we're going to be talking about today and um as you've seen in the little intro i i was i was right um the wires got banned i mean i told you guys a lot of people didn't believe me a lot of people didn't want to listen a lot of people said no it's not broken i told you i told you that this card was going to get banned now um you know it's it's i feel a little bit good but anyways no let, let let's let's just talk about it gofu uh let's just start from the beginning we just get to double r's and the um other card also and then i mean talk about it from there but anyways first off there's gofu dandelion double iris uh level eater maxi and a joker and i believe uh oh well didn't mean to do that um, but I believe that's all that was banned, which was, uh, we could just go ahead and go through some of them really quickly. Gofu, clearly, I mean, who, who didn't see that dandelion? I'm kind of surprised. Kind of not, though, because that means we most likely are getting that arrow mage link in the next set. So, that's good. Um, level eater. I mean, that's gotta suck for people who, who you know, bought the link Karibos. But, you know... They'll, they'll find some other way to use it. it it's it's still okay. Um, uh, Maxi, finally. I mean, I'm happy with it. I hate getting Maxied uh, more than I hate getting Ashed. So, I mean, I'm, I'm fine with that. And Joker in Double Iris Magician. Now, I told you guys in my previous video, when I was doing my predictions, that double iris was most likely well i felt like it should it should get banned and you know konami agreed with me why double iris needed to get banned is because once again folks it's like the plush fire syndrome it's not once per turn and it also searches spells and traps that's a big problem and the trap was the only reason everybody really had hard a hard time against pendulum magicians that was literally well in let's, let's say in my case when I when I play against pendulums, most of the time I would say ninety percent of the time the reason I lose is because of the trap. Like I can fight through the monsters. That's not. I mean I don't care that you search six different pendulum monsters and you did all these double omegas and stuff. That's completely fine. The fact is that after I get through that, I have to deal with the trap card that literally says. Even if I if it doesn't destroy, it still can send an extra card. I mean, send a send a card on the field to the graveyard. And if I, you guys don't think that's broken, I don't know what to tell you. Double Iris getting that immediately, and especially especially with a Electrum, one Joker, a, a Joker like a Joker in Ravine was going to get you so much so much farther in the game than your opponent. The fact that you can use you know Double Iris to search two different cards. In the same turn, you can search a continuous that gets you a monster. Then you can search a um, continuous spell to get you a monster. Then you can also search a continue trap to pretty much protect yourself, which was way too good. Konami obviously seen the problem. They hit it. Joker, you know what? Um, you could have put Joker to one. You could have put Wisdom out of one. I think that would have been better. Putting Banning Joker, that's even, you know, that's is technically better because now. They don't have just one card searching tuning magician. Now they have to hard draw the pendulum graph spell, which I'm pretty sure they're going to cut out. And I'm pretty well looking at it right now. I think a lot of people are going to be cutting out the um, magician part of the deck. Most likely, I don't know. This is what I'm looking at because what is the point of playing it? 
it's literally bad like double iris was possibly the only good one astrograph sorcerer yes it's still going to be played but you no longer have the you know your turn one shadows so i think they're going to you know throw in the mythical beast which um if you guys have not uh, i mean if you guys haven't seen the set i didn't know the mythical beast cerberus was a secret and <clears throat> i feel like that card is really going to be good um if you haven't read the effect um yeah yeah it's pretty good it banishes a monster on the field and it gains the attack so i mean it, you guys know that in pendulums that's actually really good kind of reminds me of a kieran um but we'll see it's a level eight so it's kind of hard to summon but like i said we'll see how that goes but anyways yeah man double iris just needed to get hit i mean needed to get banned either that or the trap card and you know like i said in the video if you hit the trap card it's not really fair because you get if you have no way to search the trap card now it's just a regular trap card which i'm pretty sure they're going to play three of and once again um you pretty much took six cards out of the uh, seven cards technically but you took six cards out of the magician deck so now the consistency is down and now i have to find different ways but don't be alarmed everybody don't go sell your electrums and stuff like that or whatever the case don't go sell your little magician core be be patient most likely this next week we're going to see one of the best decks i mean is they're going to evolve i guarantee you pendulums are going to evolve um pick up some waiver knives though i think that may also be a good thing anyways let's go on to the limited which is towers grinder golem knight assailant and no shit no performance <laughs> juggler firewall dragon uh, monster reborn spiral resort and solemn judgment the only card i got right on here was the spiral resort i mean pretty much everybody can see that spirals are you know pretty much out of the spotlight might as well throw them in the dirt one resort is actually still decent for them they just can't play master plan and master plan was literally the way to play that deck so now that they don't have master plan you're probably going to see stun variants which you know is going to you know possibly may see an appearance but i don't think the deck is i don't think people are going to play the deck i just think they got tired of it and the fact that a lot of his stuff is limited it just no there's no reason to play it even though it is very cheap and it's a very powerful deck i just think people aren't going to play it after the first month or two or however long we have this ban list um after the first month you'll stop seeing spirals and then yeah um towers coming back uh we have kaiju so it's really not a problem i guess i mean it's not as scary as it once was and there's a bunch of more different cars that can easily you know out of towers so that's not really you know troublesome so grind to golden golden going limited i thought it would be banned they limited it okay um i guess um that it's, it's just dumb to limit it because you literally only need one but uh, i i guess um former star dam damage juggler perform mage damage juggler okay well i guess um they could have just you know like i said moved a whole bunch of cards to limited but i mean putting juggler to one is okay um it's actually a pretty real real is actually not decent but it's a really good card so i mean it's, it's actually pretty good firewall dragon did not see that one coming um wow that's uh it's pretty crazy i didn't really think that firewall would get hit even though it, it needed to get hit as soon as it was printed and this is why you don't print stuff like this can i mean you just don't print stuff like this it's not it's not it's not cool i mean there's no reason to limit it because you know most people only play one or two so you stop the little otk decks which is good um but you know it's it's, it's whatever monster reborn um that's pretty crazy uh yeah i mean it's not a ratted or anything so i mean we got a free reborn i'm i'm good with that i already talked about resort and solemn judgment which i feel um like a people are once again they're gonna see it come off the list everybody's gonna rush to get it then they're gonna find out that this game is not is not for solemn judgment this game is completely no you not do not play solemn judgment folks i repeat unless you're playing the counter counter deck do not play solemn judgment you're going to lose a lot of games this is not old Yu Gi Oh, where you can solemn judgment and live a turn there's cards that will hit you with four thousand there's decks that can hit you with four thousand do not do that please don't because if you solemn judgment and you're playing against trick stars you might as well just pick your cards up if you solemn judgment you're playing against pendulums pick your cards up. i'm trying to tell you solemn judgment it's most likely going to be going three in the next form. I mean, next game, I, you're going to see people with it. Do not get mad. I'm just letting you know, solemn judgment. Do not play this card. It is not good. 
It is not is nowhere near shape or form. No, no, no. Let, let, let's put this right. Solid Judgment is a good card. It's not good for this format. You do not want to be paying half your life points. There's a reason why hero decks are, really can't compete. Um, not only do you know, I mean, it, it, it. A lot of his stuff is, you know, pretty much, you know, I guess, he lacking. But the fact that the most powerful spell, which is Heroes Live, pay half your life points. Trust and believe, you will get OTK. In the, in, in this generation of Yu-Gi-Oh, you will get OTK. Solemn Judgment is a great card, yes, but you will get OTK. It's not worth it. Do not play it, folks. Now it's a lesson from Busted. All right. Anyway, semi-limited. Like I said in my previous video i mean i thought some cards can go to semi-limit which was uh torrential bottomless you know stuff like that they decided to put it three like i but you know i don't know why they didn't put burial three like what they should have took off this all this stuff off i mean there's no reason for it to be semi-limited um but also uh at three well in, in, in my semi-limited list um what i put was um you know uh, bottomless trap hole, torrential, and dark hole because I thought that you know at least Konami would hit a hand trap, but <clears throat> Konami actually made a card that stops hand trap, so I guess that's kind of a hit to a hand trap. Um, so I guess that's the reason why they didn't do it. But like I said, if they did, well, pretty much they did kind of hit hand traps. So when you do that, you have to bring in more mass destruction. They went full face into it, which you know I I, I don't I don't kind of agree with, but hey, we're going we're going to see it. So anyways. The unlimited, as you can see, are, are Moral Tech, Black Cluster Soldier, Car Trooper, Thunder King, Brionic, Brain Control, El Shadow Fusion, Future Fusion, Mind Control, Preparation of Right Sacrifice, uh, Bottomless Trap Pulse, Ceasefire, Drum Tree, and Torrential Tribute. Now, Moral Tech possibly is definitely, no, no, not possibly, is definitely going to see some play. Um, sadly, I just sold my, uh, my uh, Sanctums, so that sucks. But you're going to see some Moral Techs. You, you might see a stun deck. Stun is looking really good. Now, I thought Security Border was a, a okay card. It's it's a really good card. I, I, I really underestimated it. It's it's a really good card. Um, but you can't activate effects either, so I don't know how that would work. But Security Border is a very terrific card. Black Luster Soldier, I don't know why it's at three. It's only going to, I'm trying to tell you, Konami is going to take that one deck that just happens to be able to do at Listen, Izo just came out. Izo can search any warrior in the game, add it to your hand. You just can't summon it that turn. That is completely fine. Trust me, and uh, like I said, I said it last list and it didn't happen. But this list, we, it's, it's a, there's no more spirals, so there's no more one deck lockdown. I mean, as of right now, we just have an open format. BLS may get limited in the next 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 list because everybody's gonna play it. Card two bad three. Sure, we get some troop group combos that can possibly go back down um, to where it came from. Thunder King Ryo being at three, relax. AVG Dun Thunder King Ryo being at three is kind of sucky. I, I don't really want to play against stun, but hey, it, it can be a three. Brionic doesn't matter, it's shitty. Um, Brain Control was probably one of the worst cards in the game. El Shadow Fusion, sure. Future Fusion, sure. Mind Control, that is uh, that's 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 pretty crazy. Um, I don't know about mind control. Mind control is should not have just randomly went to three. Two, yeah, sure, let's test it. Putting it to three, uh, I don't know, man. A lot of people don't really play that many stat stealing cards like to take your opponent's monsters. Mind control may be a problem. Maybe, maybe not. Preparation of rights. I don't play it, so I don't care. Um, may play it, but I, I really don't. It's just really not that good in Vendred. Uh, sacrifice, sure. Bottomless trap hole. I, it, I, I just barely started playing that card. Thank God, that card is amazing. Um, Ceasefire. I don't. I don't. I hate burn cards, so I don't understand why they did it. But I guess a drama trio, same thing. And torrential tribute, which is um, very crazy that it's at three, but it's going to stop a lot of that spam stuff. You're not just going to run straight into a back row. But then also, hey Trunade now jumps up to probably like twenty to twenty-five dollars. Because everybody's going to play back row for the first couple of months. Hey, Trune is going to spike up. And then when people stop playing back row, they're just going to spike back down. But hey, Hey, Trune is actually a decent pool if you do um, buy a box. And uh, I did buy a box. And um, what I ended up pulling was uh, Electrum. 
and a blue sky, the Mech Knight blue sky, forty days old also, uh, and and I did pretty good. Now I was a little sad. I had my 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 my, my garbage camera, and um, it was in my backpack, but I didn't not it it the whole thing was folks. I was a, I, I bought a box, and then my brother said, well, you know, he's gonna save one for the channel. So I said, okay, I'm gonna open mine. I pulled an Electrum, sold my Electrum, got my Skull Deep. And you know, I got all my Vendray cards, my downbeats, um, thanks to uh, some friends because they helped out. And you know, I was very glad about that. Thank you, thank you if you're watching this video. Um, and my brother, uh, he bought he bought a box, pulled a Skull Deep, bought another box, pulled a Skull Deep, and bought a third box, and then pulled a Skull Deep and an Electrum. And that third box was supposed to be for the channel, but he decided to open it so yeah that would have been good but yeah thank you guys for watching I hope you guys did enjoy my band list talk i know it was pretty long most likely and i uh, hope you know let me know what you guys think man is this uh, i kind of like the list um i'm just excited to play Yu-Gi-Oh. we finally got a band list is get things swinging back uh i mean get things you know swinging back in motion is that is that the word i should say yeah we get things swinging back in motion um so yeah let me know how you guys think and uh not, not how you guys think but let me know what you guys think and uh yeah see you guys uh monday with another video oh uh, see i almost deleted it again <laughs>